Hello, hello, hello. Good to see you. You get fairy dust and I get fairy dust and Amelie gets fairy dust. And guys, I just need to make a public service announcement about fairy dust. When you put too much fairy dust in your life, all sorts of things will happen. Like, I had no idea that fairy dust would turn my hair like this. Like living the fairy dust life, like I had no idea. Pretty. All right. I wanna talk about the insult, because <laughs> that's what it is. You've changed. So, <laughs> speaking of which, you've changed. So, when you do your advanced personal growth work, you are going to change. Like, it's just going to happen, and it will all be for the better. It'll all be for your highest good, and it'll all be for the other person's highest good, and it'll be for the world's highest good. And, um, and when other people aren't doing their advanced personal growth work, do, 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 they're like, no, 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 you don't get to do yours. You don't get to be happy. You don't get to live your life. You don't get to be free. And so one of the things that they say, they can't just say, you know, stop being healthy, stop going to therapy, stop going to your AA meetings. Like they don't say that, they can, of course. So they say something more passive aggressive, something more subliminal, like the statement you've changed. And it, it actually hurts and it's, it's hard to hear because we, we know, which is, it's so ironic because our whole culture is about personal growth and all this stuff, but, but it's just like, oh yeah, personal growth, you know, get a coach, get a therapist, but I didn't mean that you should actually get better. Uh, so, so um, I was thinking about the whole you've changed things because you can't help it when you see a whole different hair color in the mirror. Um, so one of them is, um, and, and some things, I mean, every, if I was writing this, of course, there would be a lot, a lot less stutters, a lot less tangents. I'd be super better at editing, but I think there's some things that are just better to see an advanced bitch say or do so you can see what it looks like in the world. And so advanced bitches use tools. If you're interested in the, all the other things advanced bitches do, you can head up to um, my bio and click on the Bitchifesto if you're interested. All right, so one of the advanced bitch principles from bitch principles, we don't mispronounce bitch, um, principles from the advanced Bitchifesto is advanced bitches use tools. And one of our tools are scripts. And so, um, and sometimes we need to have some scripts locked and loaded. And I would say, if you're engaging with me, if you're connecting with me, then you are doing advanced personal growth work. Even if you're not changing anything in your life, just know by watching this and listening and watching somebody who is living by the Bitchifesto that, um, it's actually helping you. Even if you don't make one change in your life, for years. And let's say you just never made a change in your life, but seeing other people and having truth resonate is actually helpful. So that, so I wanted to record this instead of write it out. Okay, so my number, my new, so I'm, and, and understand I haven't done this yet. So usually I tell you things that I've done and so you know that it can be done and it is, but, but I'm gonna try it. So what my promise is to you is that when it happens and it will, Someone's gonna say you've changed in, you know, in the way that they do. And it's on its way. I don't need to worry about it, it is on its way. And, and so I'm gonna try to have locked and loaded this. Okay, so let's just say, Amelie says, you've changed. And also that face, you've changed. And so this is what I wanna do. Instead of like, no I haven't. Um, yes, I have. That's, they're actually saying something true. So being defensive is um, not the way to go. So here's what I'm going to try. You've changed. Oh my God, thank you so much. Thank you, thank you for noticing. I've been working really, really hard at it. 
So I really appreciate you noticing and that, that just means a lot to me. And <laughs> end of script. <laughs> I'm gonna try it. I'm gonna say next time somebody says you've changed, I'm gonna say, oh my God, thank you. Oh shit, thank you so much. As if they, as if they told me like, you know, like I want an Oscar. <laughs> present to you you've changed oh my god thank you I'd like to thank um, my therapist I'd like to thank Amelie I for her unconditional love I'd like to thank you've changed they give you an Oscar bitch I'm gonna need an Oscar oh shit I'm gonna need an Oscar time to go to Etsy <laughs> If any of you know any good Etsy stores that have cool shit, let me know. I'm all into that and supporting artists. Okay. The other one is, so you've changed. Um, oh shit, what was the other thing I was gonna say about you've changed? Um, it, it, I think the other one I was gonna say was just that knowing what it is, understanding what code for you, you changed is, which is I don't like um, that you are getting better. I don't, you know, it's just code for that. Um, the other one, which is, and again, when I say things, I, one of my, uh, character defects, like with a capital C and a capital D is sarcasm. Like it's really, really bad. And even when I'm in session, sometimes I'll say like, try, you know, what about this script? And I'll say, and I 100% know I sounded sarcastic when I said it, and you, it's not supposed to be sarcastic. I have to actually tell them that the way I said it wasn't right because I can't help but be sarcastic. Um, and so I'm working on it. Conscious, more conscious every day. Uh, so, um, so someone says you change, and then, and you know, and what you can say out loud or think is, I know, and I'm sorry, I'm so sorry you're not. I'm so sorry you're not changing. You know, I am evolving, I'm growing, I'm, you know, busting my ass, I'm, I'm working on my body, I'm working on my mind, I'm working on my psyche, I'm working on every bit of me, I'm working on my glamour, I'm working and trying to grow and grow and, and, it's like, yeah, I have changed. And the thing is, it's like, if we were in a relationship with somebody, even if it was dysfunctional, our changing, they used to keep up with it. But what they're telling us when they say, when they say you've changed, they're telling us, you know, it, it's, it's a hint that um, I can't change. I won't change. I'm not interested in changing. Um, because the whole you change thing is a hand slap, is a sarcasm, is a shame thing. And what that's supposed to do is to get you back in line, is to make you feel little. You've changed. Oh, I feel little. I'm embarrassed. I've done something wrong. And, you know, again, you can, you can come up with your own script about, you know, like, I, I really hear you when you say that, because sometimes people say it multiple times, and you can say, when, once you hear it for the fifth time, you can say, you know, I really hear, hear you when you say that I've changed, and I've been thinking about it a lot, and I actually have, and I was hoping you could come with me on the journey, but if you can, I completely understand. Again, that sounds a little sarcastic. <laughs> it's not meant to be. But that's how I truly feel in my heart. I'm growing. I'm never going to apologize for it anymore. I'm, I'm not going to stop. I'm even more dedicated. And if you and my family and my puppy and my clients and my whatever's, my family, my friends, my if they don't if they aren't if I'm changing and they don't like it, we're going to have a pickle because I do the advanced bitch number 20, which is the advanced bitch becomes the fairy godmother to the wounded child within, and bitch, I got her back. So we're gonna keep going, because this is all too good. Love you. So now you're armed and ready for, uh, you've changed. Oh, thank you. Oh my God, thank you.